Hi, I'm Annalise Jones, author of The Fruit Predominant Diet. I just wanted to take you out here with me and show you what I found. I was out picking some blackberries here, and I'm just at the edge of my neighborhood. There's some houses all around. But there's this clearing here, and it just belongs to the state or something. There's these huge blackberry brambles. I just ate dinner of blackberries. And then I saw this apple tree. I used to get really excited over these things when I first started fruit. It's just so exciting when you're out and about and you're not expecting it, and then God's like, hey, have some free food. I mean, look at this tree. Isn't this so amazing? Where do these apples come from? Nobody put them here. They just come out of nowhere every year, and they grow, and oh, it just happens to be food with water and protein and carbohydrates and minerals and vitamins, and, and it just happens to sustain life. It came out of nowhere. And then it's going to drop on the ground and wither away, and then next year it's just gonna do it all over again. Isn't that amazing? I mean, what more do you need to say, look, God created you, and God created food for you. It's just, it, it's just as simple as that. Look at that beautiful apple. <clears throat> anyway, my kids love apples. We buy them from Costco. We have to buy organic, because they're really high on the contamination list. So we buy apples from Costco. We pay 79 cents a pound every single week for a 10 or 15 pound bag. And I've picked 30 pounds already. There's another 20 pounds here. Like that adds up. If you're trying to save money or if you use that as an excuse, I can't afford to eat fruits and vegetables, then and there are a lot of avenues that are open to you. When you let, when you let God surprise you, it'll happen. It's really fun. There's so many opportunities out there. <clears throat> now I live in Oregon. There's lots of berries, wild berries, apples and pears. Everybody has apples and pear trees. They don't eat them. They drop on the ground everywhere. You know, be a little bit spunky. Knock on the door. Ask them, can I pick some of your fruit? I'll give some to you too. There's just ways around it. There's so much wonderful fruit out there. It's apple season now. There's so many different ways to eat apples. Blackberry applesauce, apricot applesauce, cinnamon applesauce. I mean, there's just really a lot of possibilities. You can do a lot with it. Don't forget, this is food straight from God. It just appeared here has everything that you need. You could live on apples, seriously. Somebody does, I read about it online. I personally will add a few more variety to my diet. Uh, anyways, I just wanted to say hi and best wishes to you. I hope that you're incorporating more fruit in your diet. I hope that you're doing good and finding good results.